most of my work is focused on new democracies, particularly countries in the Indo-Pacific region. And uh, I try to help countries that uh, are facing ethnic or other cleavages uh, and are interested in redesigning their political systems so that democracy doesn't fall apart. A lot of times reformers in a country are looking for options and they're looking for information on how a particular reform might have worked somewhere else. So in Malaysia, where there are a couple of big ethnic groups, the Malays, the Chinese, the Indians and others, we were actually talking a lot about how preferential voting could be used to help moderate ethnic tensions at elections. Now that would be a big reform if it gets introduced in Malaysia, we'll see if it, if it does. But it began a discussion about how the rules of the political game might be reformed to try and encourage better inter-ethnic relations. And there's actually lots of potential things that can be done in that field. I was able to make some arguments about how changing electoral rules in Papua New Guinea might help to encourage better relations between tribal and clan groups. And actually they ended up changing their electoral system uh, about 10 years after so I've done some consulting for the Northern Territory government where um, they had accidentally introduced an electoral system for local government elections that was causing some real uh, conflicts between different Aboriginal clans. And again, it was because the electoral system tended to have the effect of, uh, unintended effect of helping one group and uh, underrepresenting another. And so I wrote a uh, consultancy report and made some suggestions and they did end up changing the electoral system there to a much more suitable one. So I have had some opportunities to work in Australia there as well.